What we're doing right now is establishing a, a uh, emergence trap for spring run Chinook salmon reds. A red is a, a fish nest that's created by the salmon. They then spawn and the offspring are uh, fry. And essentially this is a cap that will be placed over the top of the red that will uh, capture the emergence, the fry in a, in a net, and then allow the uh, biologist to uh, measure, weigh, and uh, count the number of fry that emerge from, from the salmon nest. Essentially that gives us an indicator of uh, the uh, uh, health of the, of the uh, salmon that have been introduced to the system and how well they're doing at spawning and could uh, assist with helping us to determine uh, the number of uh, essentially baby salmon that will emerge from, from these reds. This area of the river is considered uh, the most pristine spawning habitat for Chinook salmon in the river. It has the larger gravel beds that are necessary for uh, egg laying and for spawning to take place. So this is really kind of the premier habitat for the restoration effort. Strictly from a uh, information gathering standpoint that we're doing this right now. Um, the idea is to have a self-sustaining, self-reproducing population of salmon that, that, do, that follow the natural progression and migration up from the ocean to spawn here um, and reach one of the river. And this is an indicator of uh, that occurring.